Before I get into today's video, I have two trigger warnings. The first one is that you're gonna see some cute owls. If you don't like owls or you don't like cute things, do not watch this video. The second thing is that trigger warnings don't work. My name is Dan Riskin. Every week I find five science stories that I think are just awesome. I put them into a newsletter and I send it out for free. It's called The Bat Signal and you can sign up at followthebatsignal.com. This past week my family and I went and visited Long Point Bird Observatory where they were catching northern sawwit owls, the little tiny cute ones, and putting bands on them. I'm going to show you that in two seconds, but first I want to tell you about this paper that shows that trigger warnings aren't very effective. They had 261 young adults keep track of their social media use for seven days, and about half of those people came across a trigger warning, and whenever they did come across a trigger warning, 90% of the time people just looked at the thing anyway, and it didn't matter if they had had a traumatic event in their past or if they had psychological symptoms, they were equally likely to go ahead and look at the thing that was warned about in the trigger warning. So the conclusion from the paper is that trigger warnings aren't very effective. Case in point, I warned you there were going to be owls, and look how cute they are. This is a northern sawwood owl. You can just see how adorable they are. They're migrants, so they're up in the boreal forest, up in the north, then they come down when it gets uh, to be winter, and they hunt voles and little things, but they're just so cute and little, and they have cute little faces. And now you've seen that face because you ignored the trigger warning like everybody else does. See you next week.